redeem in the time. We re we redeem back the time by not adding sin to sin. Uh, you want to offend less. And uh, uh, offend less. Redeem the time. Redeeming the time is offending less. Um, not adding sin to sin. And uh, what else? Uh, learning the will of the Lord. Buying back the time. You know, in righteousness. Buying the time back in righteousness, man. Making it up to the Lord. That's how we're gonna, you know, redeem the time. You know, we're gonna redeem it in righteousness. Now we wasted our time in wickedness. Now it is our time to uh, redeem it back. You know, because the Lord is at hand right now, and we need to. Um, get more focused than ever you know you gotta put on the whole arm of you how about Shimmy I was shy spiritually and mentally our focus has to be guided in the spirit because we've been focusing you know on the wrong things man you know as you grow in this thing you learn that you know the focus is in the Lord. It's your mind, man. This is a spiritual war, but it's also a mental war. You know, the more and more you're focused on folly, the weaker you are. And it's easy for Satan to come in and infiltrate your thoughts because you're thinking about folly. You know? But when you're thinking on your how about shim, your how was shy. Man, you're focused. And you're fighting a good fight of faith. You know? You focus on the word because the word basically is like um, the words of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai is uh, it's, uh, uh, it's a, uh, what's the word I want to use? Uh, a guide, basically. You gotta stop learning. You gotta learn how to uh, uh, not lean towards your own understanding and start leaning on the Lord. You know? Learning the will of the Lord. You know, getting your focus in, man. And focusing on the things that you how about Shim Yahweh Shai. Stop spending too much of your time playing your video game all the time, man. Or you might be spending too much time with your woman. You know, because that could throw your focus off. Well, you might be spending too much time in your, with your kids all the damn time, man. And you could be doing the work. Or you could be learning, studying, doing a video, you know, just growing. You want to grow in this thing, man. Because the more and more time you spend with the Lord, that's redeeming the time, too. Hey, the more courage you get, man. Confidence. The Lord will build you up in courage and confidence in, my, in your spirit, bro. In the, with the Holy Spirit, man. Because the Lord said for them that, are, that love me and my Father, we will come in and make our bowl with them. You know? The Lord said he'll come in and he'll suck with you, man. You know? And that's redeeming the time because now you're focused. And the more and more you focus, the better and better you will be. Not only in just knowing the scriptures, man, not only just knowing the scriptures, but also, uh, you know, applying it to your life, man. Having a new mind, you know, putting off the old man and putting on the new man. This is a daily walk, you know. I was thinking about that this morning. I was reading the book of uh, Ephesians chapter 5 this morning before I left out for work and uh, you know they're redeeming the time redeeming the time
time stuck out of my mind and it just made me look at myself as far as like what am I doing to actually redeem the time back you know am I truly redeeming the time or am I wasting precious valuable time man it just made me look at that like man you need to stop wasting your time you know don't waste your time on the world man time is valuable every bit of it your time is valuable brothers and sisters your time is valuable man don't waste your time on this world man invest your time in your how about shimmy i was shy only one thing can happen you can just get greater and that's it you'll get better that's how you redeem the time back, man. By investing it in the Lord. By back becoming like the Lord. Becoming in his likeness, man. Spending time with the Lord is just going to help you to be like the Lord. You're resembling him in the spirit, man. Walking in the spirit power. Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. Being mighty in the spirit, man. Being mighty over this this, this flesh becoming a true warrior man fighting this fight you know and redeem it back man hey the scriptures say it's high time to wake up out of sleep you know but right now it really is high time to wake up out of sleep you know this is the time right now you know <laughs> hey we at the end you know, and if you're not focused, you know, in this, in this thing, man, you're going to lose. Because you're not, you're not focused, man. And Satan is going to be able to attack you and, and, and win your, 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 your attention over. You don't want to give your attention over to Satan. You don't want to get your attention over to this world. Where it, and, and it comes in all types of shapes, forms, and sizes, man. Satan. He comes through all types of forms, shape, shapes, and sizes. Come through your family. Come through your woman, your job. You know, all of these different distractions, man. To keep you away from your how about Shimmy I was shot. To keep you from growing in the truth. He wants to keep you uh, malnutritioned. So you can be weak weak in, your, in, in, in the spirit man you won't be able to be built up in your spiritual uh, 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 what you call it uh, 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 damn what they call it respiratory system you'll be able to attack it you know and, and, then, and then you'll get sick spiritually sick now you back in the world man seven more demons attached on to you because you ain't redeeming the time you know we don't have the time man to uh you know waste time is valuable there's no time to waste man on this world man there's no time to waste on this world man we're too busy, man, fighting a good fight of faith. You got to redeem it back, man, daily. Stay focused and get rooted and grounded to become steadfast and unmovable. Through the Spirit of Paul, you how about Shemya was shy? You know, you got to keep keep going, man. Hey, the water, you how about Shemya was shy for our strong leaders, like for the apostles, you know, Apostle Tahar on down, you know, to our, our bishop elders. To all these other beautiful elders out here too that's out here man just keeping the flock you know encouraged you know to keep fighting you know because that's all it is at the end of the day it's beautiful that we got leaders like that that keep us from going off into a ditch keep us on the straight path 
going to it, Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, to keep us vibrant in this thing, man, to keep us, you know, alive, you know? Beautiful leaders, man. The water Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai for Apostle Tahar, man, and Apostle Gabar, and also for Apostle Rakai and Apostle Ramblad. The water Yah Bashim Yah for our bishop elders and the water Yah Bashim Yah you know, for the elders and all the other brothers that's in this thing fighting, man. You know, I was just thinking about that, man, redeeming the time. We got to redeem the time, man, by, you know, being occupied, man, until the Lord comes, man, spiritually and mentally. This is a mind thing. Spiritual war we're fighting, brothers. We can't let, we got to stop wasting our time and stop letting Satan infiltrate your mind and your thoughts. You know, getting you off track. The scriptures say, resist Satan and he shall flee from me. So, hey man, start resisting, man. Resist this devil, man. Stay focused. With that, man, we say shalom. Give all praises and glory and honor to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakat Kadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders. Great millstone, peace and salutations to all you Akim out here laboring in this truth and truth and sincerity. Shalom.